Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today we get to celebrate the launch of Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII Reunion, the remaster of the classic game from 2007, the prequel to Final Fantasy VII. I'm so excited to share this game with you all. We, My part on it was done so long ago and I've just been waiting to see what people would think of the new work. And honestly, the response on social media and the, and the reviews, everybody seems to really be enjoying this game. And there's so much to love about it, so that totally makes sense. But man, is it a relief. I am, it's one of those days where I'm once again, absolutely humbled and flattered and just so, so grateful that I get to be a part of a project like this. Thank you so much to everybody who is a part of that ecosystem of love and passion for this game, these characters, this whole FF7 universe. I just appreciate you all so much and I appreciate you all welcoming me as a part of it. Um, being the voice actor for Aerith has been absolutely the highlight of my life and I am, I am not understating that. So thank you all so, so much. I'm very overwhelmed, but I'm so excited to finally play this game. Um, and share this version of Aerith with all of you. Um, she's a little bit younger in this game than if you're familiar with my work in Final Fantasy VII Remake. So it was definitely a challenge, but I'm really looking forward to playing the game. And uh, I've heard the combat is super fun and satisfying too. So oh, I'm just, I'm just absolutely so stoked. It's, it's, it's a really great feeling. Thank you all so much. So uh, without any further ado, uh, please remember to like the video if you'd like to do that and we'll get on to the gameplay. Enjoy! New game! Let's get started. I don't know, I think we should play in Japanese. <laughs> I'm joking. That would be great. I'm sure it would be fantastic. But I also feel like maybe for some reason on my stream I should play in English. Uh, I personally am going to be playing in normal mode because I do not... It's not that I don't like a challenge, it's just that I don't need additional challenge. We'll just go with default camera. We'll go with default brightness. Yes, I just hope subtitles will be on. Mm, that doesn't look like English. Kicking up. We're really back here. Characterizing him. Zach. Zach, focus. There are no Shinra troops on this train. Understood? Come and get it! 
Well, that's confusing. He just said there were no Shinra troops on this train. But I feel like these are Shinra troops. Strong start that I'm already confused. <laughs> Wow, look at him go. Soldier second class sack on the job. Train mark 93 2 rerouted to sector one station near Mako Reactor. We're gonna get this shot, which is just like FF7 and FF7 Remake. Nostalgia. Just everywhere. Everything nostalgia. It always starts here at the Sector 1 station, the train platform. Zach speaking. Making progress, Zach. Angeal, what's going on? Why are we fighting Shinra troops? They're Wu Tai troops in disguise. Oh. Uh, head to the open area above. You mean towards Sector 8? Yes. But first, you're gonna have to clear a path. Clear a path? You'll see what I mean. Be careful. Uh oh. So I can cut loose, right? Within reason. And then he puts away the flip phone. Activating combat mode. Okay, so we have movement, camera, targeting. We have actions. Attack. I can do that. Guard. I won't do that. And dodge. I might do that. Equipped materia can be used by pressing the assigned buttons while holding L1. Good, good. Commands are assigned according to the slots in which materia are set through equipment in the main menu. Using magic expends MP. Using abilities expends AP. Materia that cannot be used in a battle will be dis will not be displayed as a command option. Okay, so what materia do we currently have equipped is my question. We have Thundaga. I'll show you who's boss. It's me. I'm the boss and you are dead. Wow. Oh, there's more of you. Why are there so many of you? Viraga. Yeah. And you're weakened. You're weakened because you're dead. That's rough to be you, Wu Tai troops in disguise as Shinra troops. <laughs> Not too bad. Piece of cake. I'll make first in no time. Go up the stairs at the end of the platform. You got it. <laughs> so it's interesting already that we have this contrast between Cloud, who is very stoic, and Zack, who is very fun-loving. You immediately have the contrast of these protagonists who seem on the surface very similar. Well, in their looks. Activating combat mode. Okay, here we go. The slot reels spinning at the top left corner of the screen during battle represents the digital mind wave, the DMW. When certain images or numbers match on the DMW, it provides a variety of effects. The reels expend SP to automatically spin and stop. More images are collected as the game progresses. When images match, a limit break state is entered and limit break move is added to your stock, which you can use at any time. Various enhancements are granted according to the number shown. Furthermore, when a number match occurs during a real image limit verge, 
Zack and or his equipped materia will level up. Now, I probably will forget what all of that means, but there's the difference between when the numbers match and when the images match. So when the images match, you get a limit break. When the numbers match, you just get various enhancements. But when a number match occurs during a image match, Zack and or his equipment material will level up. I don't know what it means during a real image quote unquote limit verge. I have no idea what that means, but you know, it'll do its thing in the corner and we'll do our thing and then we just get various bonuses. It sounds like a win-win. Press X to dodge. Mm. Mm. The game is teaching me to dodge and to guard, but eh. Debatable if I'll actually ever do any of that. What abilities do we have here? During battle, you can use potions and other items by pressing O. Oh. Great. Uh, seems like we don't need that just yet. Um, excuse you. Let's use Assault Twister Plus. We won't do that. We won't do that because we're reading. DMW, effects of numbers, no limit verge. If numbers match, when the image reels are not in a limit verge state, certain enhancements can be gained. DMW, effects of numbers. So 777, you're invincible for a limited time. 666, you're, you do critical damage for a limited time. 555, null physical damage for a limited time. AP cost zero, okay, okay, okay. Negative, negative seven. Negative seven, negative. Okay, so here's the important thing. The important thing is that seven is remains the perfect number. That's the important thing. It's just gonna do its thing and we're just gonna do our thing. When the image reels are in a limit verge state and numbers between one and six match, the materia set in the correspond corresponding slot <laughs> will level up. Okay. I don't know what that means. I'm even reading it and I I don't know what it means. It okay. We're gonna go with assault twister now. Nailed it. We did great. Would do again. No MP cost activated. Great, then we're gonna use as much MP as possible. We're gonna use Thundaga and we're gonna use Blizzaga and we're, yeah. Got messed up there. Okay, when all the image reels match, a limit break state is entered and a corresponding limit break move is added to your stock. A stock limit break moves can be unleashed at a time of your choosing, but they will all vanish at the end of the battle. That's an important note. You press triangle to unleash limit break which I have and I will use. Octaslash, level three. Get ready. I'm feeling it. He's feeling it. And you know what? So am I. Look at us. Look at us. We've defeated Behemoth. That's a big deal. When you're back to the enemy, overconfidence will destroy you. What is this? Long sword man. Damn it. You're not the only hero. It's over. <gasps> well, that's unfortunate. Impossible. His sword just got snapped. And Angeal got a phone call about it, I guess. That's rough. Hmm. <sighs> okay. 
interesting way to introduce this at the beginning of this game. Thanks, Angel. Because until until this game, we only really knew Sephiroth as a villain in FF7. Oh man, good old fashioned cell phones from the early 2000s. Good times. Training's over. Why? You serious? I was just getting warmed up. Wait, his sword is actually broken? That was just a mission. What? Zach. <gasps> the Buster Sword. Your dreams. Huh? If you want to be a hero, you need to have dreams and honor. Poor guy. He's like, dreams and honor? Mm. It's kind of asking a lot, you know? Title screen. Should we save the game? I think we should. Fantastic. Prologue cleared. And then we're done. <gasps> hey, Our Zach, first set of squats. A little on edge. Can you blame me? All this training and no assignments like they're hanging me out to dry you must be pretty busy with everyone off base uh, off base wait haven't you heard there's been a mass desertion at soldier huh one of the firsts has deserted took a bunch of seconds and thirds with him all from Wutai. Motive, goal, all a mystery right now. Mm -hmm. This mass soldier desertion is why your training's on hold. Whoa, a first. Zach, you're up. Yeah, finally. He's literally Time just been doing action. squats, waiting. Yes, it'll be your show. Yes! Report to Director Lazard. There'll be a briefing. On our way to Director Lazard, I suppose. Zach. It's good to finally meet face to face. Lazard, Director of Soldier. Good to meet you, sir. Hey, uh. <laughs> hey, uh. On to business. Soldier First Class Genesis. A month ago, he went missing during a mission in Wutai. Know anything about this? Not a clue. Hmm. The mission is currently stuck in limbo. That's why we've decided to send you. Uh, to Wutai? Yes. This war has gone on long enough. I've recommended huh? you for first. <laughs> oh, Angel! I love you, man! <laughs> Angel! Ugh. Don't make me regret this, uh, <laughs> sir. He's so overexcited. Back, you'll leave at once. This Zach does not know how to read the serious tone of a room. After entering Wu Tai, we go straight to work. If you have any questions about missions and combat, he can help you. Wait, why is hey, his Zach, sword not broken? Anything you want to know? Just ask. 
Why is his sword not broken again? It was broken in the room. It's not important. It doesn't matter. First, we should really go over combat. You probably got a handle on it in training, but I sent you a mail explaining the basics. Oh. Take a look, okay? I can't wait to read my mail. As the story progresses, you will receive mail from various people. You can view your mail by going to mail in the main menu. When you have unread mail, you can select R1 from the field menu to open it directly. Check your mail regularly. This is important. You can also check tutorials and useful tips from the mail menu. Well, I'm gonna read it right now. They mailed me the tutorial? I have to open all these to clear them. I'm a notification clearer. I have to clear them. All of this is pretty standard um, attack spells. And by standard, I mean if you've played Final Fantasy VII Remake, this is going to be somewhat familiar to you regarding support spells like barrier, recovery spells like cure, attack spells, status ailments, poison silence, curse stun stop. Pretty standard stuff. Um, the DMW we've already read and already didn't make sense. The controls, they already kind of gave us this. The only question I would have are SP points are soldier points and it's what makes the DMW spin. There will be more uses for SP besides spinning the DMW th throughout the game. Okay, great. So as it turns out, I didn't really have mail. Oh, I can access the Shinra shop whenever I want. That's pretty cool. Restores HP, restores MP, restores AP, heals all status ailments. Great, fantastic. Okay, so let's see what he has to say. We go straight to work. If you have any questions. Okay, what do you have to say? You will take over the assignment as Genesis's replacement. As soon as you're ready, proceed to Wu Tai. Okay. So, did you read it? I did, kind of. I, I skimmed it. Thoughts? I mean, I doubt you'd get it all in one read. What do you mean you'd get it all in one read? Is he insulting Zack's intelligence here? That is so not true. Yeah, exactly. Well, it's there if you want to review. Hmm. No, the materia you were using during training has been taken back. They took my materia. What am I gonna do? Powerful materia have to be earned. Those are the soldier rules. Hmm. Now, let's talk about missions. Hmm. The various services Shinra provides for civilians, those are what we call mission. To take on missions, you first have to register your information on the mission board. Seems like we should do that. Areas that can be checked using X will be indicated by a marker. Register, you can look up mission information on your handset. I'll show you how to register on the board. Come on. Okay, let's do it. I will say it is very fun and interesting to be sort of, you know, you know Shinra as the enemy when you play FF7 or FF7 Remake, but then you come into Crisis Core and you are Shinra. You're in Shinra. And so that's kind of like a fun little reversal. So there's a compass at the top. Check it often. Open the map. Great. Now that you're officially registered, you should try a mission. Oh, should we? Oh, yeah. Good idea. Is it a good idea when you've just taken all of our materia? The save points that way. If you're not completely sure about something, read the tutorial mail that I sent you. We're not going to do that. Your progress can be saved at save points and HP, AP, and MP are fully restored at save points. Bench? Are you telling me that this little icon can replace bench? I feel like we deserved a bench, honestly. 
Registering to take on missions can only be done at save points. So let's just take on a little sample mission. You can register to go on missions by going to a save point and selecting missions from the main menu. When you clear a mission, you'll receive rewards. You can take on available missions at any time. So you should take them on when you feel you are under leveled or wish to improve your battle skills. Oh. Telling them, telling me to take them on when I'm under leveled seems like a trap. A little bit of a trap. Okay, so we could get, we could do this one, training mission, to get an elixir. Feel like we've already kind of done it, but we're gonna try it again anyway. Activating combat mode. The limit gauge has five stages, and the higher the stage, the higher the probability for a limit burge to occur. The gauge st status changes according to various factors, such as entry, limit break, or receiving certain attacks. Limit gauge stages from highest to lowest. Heavenly, sky high, high, normal, or low. Okay. Abilities such as Assault Twister become more effective if they are used after attack. The more successive attacks come before it, the stronger it becomes. Good to know. So then in theory, it should be very powerful now. And now I was right. All right. Oh yeah, we're learning about combat. We got an elixir out of it. Mission accomplished. Victory fanfare. So fun. Nice work. You cleared the mission. Uh, thanks. I could have done it blindfolded. <laughs> You're the man. I can't wait to see how you do in Wu Tai. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. Let me explain about these supply pods. Tell me. In these pods, tell me more. You'll find items that you can use in battle. Compliments of the company. I'll take everything. So they're provisions for soldier members. I'll take them. Make sure they don't go to waste. Don't explain any more. Pods before every mission. Just give me the items. I wonder what's in there today. I'll take them all. Take! Why are we taking from pod 6, though? I feel like we should take from pod 7. Alright, looks like you're all ready to head out. Lastly, let me tell you about mail. You've already told me about mail, sir. I have new Just mail. Now, I sent mail to your handset. When did you do that? You can also get messages from Director Lazard and news about the company via mail. You should check it regularly. You did mention that. Who knows? Maybe you'll even get mail from new friends you make. Yes! But don't just read mail that you get from girls, okay? Don't just read mail that you get from girls, okay? <laughs> well, I guess that's everything. <laughs> looks like it's time for you to head out. You're with Angeal, right? Good luck. Yeah, thanks for all the help. I just really didn't feel like he was being very helpful, so I had to mock him a little bit. Um, okay, so equipment. Zach can equip up to six materia, four accessories. That'll increase. You can change the equipment. Battle commands will be set. Use up to five equipment sets. Items can be purchased at any time through the shop. Great. Let's read our mail that's not from a girl. Congrats on your first mail from Kunsel. Kunsel here. Is it Kunsel? I feel like that's a weird name. Now that you've got your mail account ready, allow me, your loyal and well-connected pal, to give you lots of insider info. Why? Because I'm such a nice guy. And I know you and your one-track mind don't know what I know. I sort of feel like... <laughs> um... <laughs> Moved mail to soldier folder. Oh, Zach is a zero inbox kind of guy. Okay. Here we are. 
reading Shinra News. Is that what we're doing? Okay, Shinra News, Midgar Construction Project. Midgar is a city floating 300 meters in the air, linked to the ground by train and highway transit. We utilize a total of eight Mako reactors, sequentially numbered, starting with the northern reactor to supply electricity to the city. Construction continues smoothly. Shinra Company headquarters in Sector 4 are the last on the schedule to be completed. The headquarters interior in Sector 0 is complete and already in operation. The exterior is slated for completion in two years, while the surrounding city will be finished in seven years. A perfect number. Reeve Tuesti, Director of City Planning. Moved mail to Shinra News folder. Great. Thanks. Thanks. Mailbox. Okay, so why don't we take a look at our equipment because we did get a bangle. Okay, there's more to learn. Equipping materia allows you to use various magic and abilities. Some materia have parameter values such as mag plus three attached to them. So keep in mind to equip materia with the highest value. Okay. Some materia become more effective when they level up. Levels indicated by the number of stars. If you feel an enemy is too strong, try something else. Materia's power can be judged by values such as sword 20 seen at the bottom of the icon. Fantastic. So currently we have fire equipped, we have blizzard equipped, we have cure and assault twister equipped, and we can equip a bronze bangle, so that's exactly what we'll do. Fantastic. Everybody wins. Is there anything else I can take from here? Hey, hey, don't get greedy. But what if I want something else? You get, you know? The company's not that generous. Well, I feel like maybe it should be. Buddy. What if I just Try to take it again. Hey, hey, there's a limit. Okay, did we do all the missions that we could possibly do here? Yeah, so we're gonna move on. There's little time. Please get ready to go at once. I am. I'm ready. I'm ready. You're with Angeal, right? Good luck. Thank you. Oh, go back to Angeal. Okay, there we go. I know how to follow a compass. <laughs> it's time to head to Wu Tai. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm so ready. I'm all set. Bring it on. I'll be joining you as well. I'm counting on you. Sir. By the way, what is your dream? To become first? Is it? No. To become a hero. Ah, good. Unattainable dreams are the best. <laughs> uh, thanks. <laughs> Awkward. That's that's quite the leader. Unattainable dreams are the best Fort kind. Tamblet. That's Let's nice for you, kiddo. Is Let's what he go. basically said. The unit is already standing by. You two there. Hold it. Okay then. Leave this to me. You better watch out. I did a training mission. Activating combat mode. Take that. Yeah. Um honestly, like Later. destroyed you. Oh, yeah. yeah. Destroyed. Destroyed okay, them. Next. Calm down, Zach. No can do. Calm down, Zach. I mean, the director is watching, right? So I have to make a good impression. Zach. Heard of dumb apples? <laughs> no, what's that? Incredible. You really don't know. Well, so much for you making first. <laughs> Whoa, wait. What's this dumb apple? Is that like wordplay? I'm confused. I don't I don't yet know that reference, but <laughs> Activating combat mode. Out of the way. You can flee from a battle by running towards the border. Well, I'm not a fleer, so uh hello! That was the rudest thing you've ever done in your life, and I think you should pay for it. Yeah. That's a bad way to die, being lit on fire. So. Oh yeah. Activating 
in combat mode. And it's time to fight again, huh? You didn't get enough last time? You think that you're gonna stab me with that spear? You won't. I won't let... Okay, you will, but then I'll kill you anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah. One might even say. So, Angeal, what's the deal with dumb apples? The official name is Benora White. The trees bear fruit at random times during the year. Because of that, the townspeople affectionately call them dumb apples. The local farms had plenty of them to spare. Oh, really? So you stole them? We were poor, Zach. Nice excuse. <laughs> but even then, I had my honor. You had the honor in stealing? Tree grew on a wealthy man's estate. It was rumored that those apples tasted the best. But I never stole from that tree because the wealthy man's son was my friend. Mm, okay, if personalization. Friend, you should have just asked for some. Honor can be quite a burden at times. And what exactly does this have to do with me? No story is not worth hearing. Mm, I feel like some stories can be real dumb apples. <laughs> That's it? Yeah, well, thanks a lot. So already they're setting up this like mentor mentee sort of relationship between the two of them, which is adorable. Ooh, okay. And we have new mail from Sir Lazard. Soldier members, I thank you for your daily hard work. As you all well know, a great number of our comrades have left the company. There is now some concern with in the company whether this will lead to a decline in soldiers' combat abilities. However, we can also take this pressure as a chance to prove how indispensable we are to the company by proving our strength as a small but elite group. I hope you take advantage of this mission where we will be bringing an end to the war with Wu Tai to do your best and prove yourselves. Okay. Oh good, he gets his own category, good. He, Zach makes folders in his mail like I do. Let's see, do we have a little mission available? We don't. So instead we'll just save the game because it feels right. The unit will set off an explosion. That's our cue. The diversion will allow us to infiltrate. Right. Thank I'll you for explaining that for me, Zach. Fortress. You'll charge. The I get what you were doing. And uh huh. And? and 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 indulge yourself. You got it. What a dork. That's what I do best. Uh, come on, B unit. How come he doesn't have any materia you know, in his never sword? Actually seen you use that. What? Don't you think it's sort of a waste? Use brings about wear, tear, and rust. And that's a real waste. You're serious, aren't you? Yeah. I can be pretty cheap. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> There's our diversion. Heightened emotions have affected the DMW. As you progress through the story, Zach's emotions toward characters he meets are sometimes heightened and this in turn affects the, TM the DMW. When Zach's emotions are heightened, the relevant character's image reels have a greater chance of entering the limit verge. It's just one man, but behind that just one man is Activate me. 
just one girl. Attack targets are chosen automatically, but the player can also manually lock on and switch targets freely. Great, happy with that. That worked out fantastic for me. Don't hit me with that. You know what? All of you, knock it off. Yeah, exactly. Doing some lighten on fire, which is fantastic. Oh. Gonna have to light you on fire as well. Because you're a Wu Tai sergeant, and I feel like that means. I don't know, you have more HP, who knows? Well, what am I supposed to do with you? Just light you on fire? Okay. How about you? What? I missed! What is that? What am I supposed to do with you? There we go. We just have to hit. We're so out of MP. Conflict <laughs> resolved. Yeah. Piece of cake. This battle music is great though, right? It's the intruder! It's soldier! Damn! Stop him! Activating combat mode. Got him! Oh, that was very exciting, Zach. Take that. Take that. Oh yeah. Are you in? Piece of cake. Could have done it blind. Piece of cake. Stay alert. I've heard the Wu Tai keep a monster around for anti-soldier purposes. It should be somewhere in the fort. So, if I can take it out, will I make first? Depends on the quality of work. Your main task is diversion. Run amok and gather attention. Well, we all know he's good at that. And you'll gain favor with Director Lazard. That'll be a cakewalk. Just watch. He loves talking about cake. Enter Fort Tamblin and defeat as many troops as possible. The more enemies you defeat, the better your evaluation as soldier will be. Wutai troops are lurking within various places, such as rotating walls and fortress towers. Make sure that you do a thorough search. That's kind of exciting. In the field, use dash to move quicker. Ooh, I see something that I can take. No! Magic attacks are effective against enemies with elemental weaknesses. Weaknesses can be identified that appears near an enemy's name. Okay, weak to blizzard. Sounds good. Oh, I missed. Later. Conflict resolved. Do a thorough search. So take eight hours searching this. Got it. Take. I honestly feel like there's something going on here, but I don't know what it is. There he is. Get him. I'm out of MP! Well, I need one of these then. That was easy. Great. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! 
Moving on. Activating combat mode. I do feel like I need a little bit of health, though. There we go. A little bit of health. And let's just blizzard you because it one shots you. Great. Oh Conflict yeah. Resolved. Conflict resolved. Fire! Fire! Okay. That's how it rotates. Okay, cool. Activating combat mode. Great. Fantastic. So the walls rotate. Come and face us, soldier! If you dare! I do dare, actually. Huh? Where did he go? Sneaky little pest. Hi there. Treachery! <laughs> Treachery. He used the wall we were just in. How dare he? Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. This is Lazard. Lazard? Enemies appear to be lurking in every corner. This fortress will not fall easily. Yeah, just now, I was checking out a revolving wall and was jumped. Other walls may be trapped too. Stay alert. Remnant forces seen near the revolving walls. Okay. Well, we don't have an option of interacting with that again. Pretty sure that's the way we came. This is where those other forces, ooh, take. Got ourselves a potion. I like, ooh, take again. <laughs> they really gotta stop just leaving random equipment. It was a trap! Activating combat mode. Well then. Later. Later. Gosh, that's perfect. That's just great. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. All right, any more revolving wall shenanigans here? Doesn't seem like it. What else do we got here? It's all about running amok. Activating combat mode. Oh, dang. Oh, I'm gonna die. I didn't die, luckily. I thought I was going to, and then I didn't. Any more revolving wall nonsense here? Okay. There he is. Get him. What if you didn't, though? Activating combat mode. I feel like these things got just kind of weaker. Ooh, my materia has grown stronger. That's fantastic. Okay, I can go this way and this way. I'm gonna take this first. Take. And take. Oh, oh. Don't hit me. I'm busy here, okay? Take. Okay, let's see what's behind curtain number one. Activating combat mode. Got him. Mm, just unfortunate to not be as good at the game as me. Conflict resolved. Really unfortunate. Oh yeah. Okay, so we came through there. Good, we checked that out. That's where we came from. We got our take. What else? We make our stand here. Ready, um, you'll be making your fall here, unfortunately for you. Give it up. More troops are on route. 
It's over! My job here is to run amok. He's charging! Stand strong and charge back! Alright, bring it on! Oh! They oh abandoned him! Oh that's rough. That is bad news bears for you. That is really bad news bears for you. Sorry, buddy. Long live will die. Except no. You gotta stop missing those because honestly, it's kind of rough. Great. Who needs Blizzard? Who needs elemental weaknesses? Not I. Good work, Zach. Enemy forces within the fort have been halved. You halved? The central area. I killed like 200. Understood. Eliminate any remaining enemies you find. Okay, we gotta find one more set of enemies and take this take. Ether, that's perfect. That'll really help. Now this is where I charged in, but there's gotta be, aha! One more set of baddies. Prepare to die. Activating combat mode. Yeah, really just too easy. Oh yeah. Okay, now we can head back. But it won't be going that way. We'll be going this way. And then we charged in through here. And then we followed these fellas. And then here we're done. Soldier first class. Zach. Nice oh wait. We have successfully occupied the fort. I just needed you to keep their attention, but <laughs> impressive. You did well. Keep pressing forward. Great. Keep pressing forward, we shall. Ah, that must be the central area. Well, which way should we go? Activating combat Whoa. mode. Apparently this way. Got him. I did sense that death Take was that. a little imminent. Conflict resolved. Later. Activating uh -huh. combat Aha! <laughs> There's so many! Oh yeah. oh yeah. Take. Oh, why did I use that potion when I had this? Definitely save the game. And basically all you have to do is just pretend that I just sat on bench because now, oh, we have mail too. Let's take a look. Situation with Wutai. We have received reports from the security and soldier departments on the state of the war with Wutai. We have been in negotiations with Wutai for years in order to peacefully resolve the long dispute regarding Mako extraction in the region. However, Wutai's steadfast refusal has resulted in aggravated tensions. In order to break through this impasse, we have decided to resume military action. A special attack force of the smallest size has been mobilized to keep the scale of operations to a minimum. I feel like... The small, a special attack force of the smallest size is literally two. It's just Zach and Angeal. Ooh, take.
Oh, that's something to click. Okay, well, let's just see if we missed anything over here. Ah, oh, well, it's a good thing we checked. Activating oh, mode. I mean, we'll, we'll fight too. Don't run away. Conflict resolved. Activating combat mode. What? I don't have to fight all of you, do I? Take that. Do you all watch how much I guard late? Conflict resolved. Oh, yeah. I'm always guarding a second after I get hit. Like, what is the point? Activating combat no, mode. you're not back. What is this nonsense? I just wanted to check for takes. Don't come back. Let me clear this area. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, okay, 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 okay. What's this? That looks like Leviathan. That is Leviathan. We are the Wutai Army's elite, the Crescent. We serve Leviathan and smite Wutai's enemies. Soldier of Shinra, a query. Is the goal of this invasion to spread your Mako reactors? Probably. Yes. A reactor here would allow people to live better lives. And that includes you. This better life that you speak of comes at the grave cost of losing our homeland. Pain and despair, that's what you bring. <sighs> One more question. You have power, so I must ask, why do you use it to cause evil? Is it wrong to spread happiness through Mako energy? Is that what you consider evil? I thought we could reason with each other as warriors. But sadly, I was mistaken. Then let us settle things as warriors. Come forth! Activating combat mode. We didn't have to fight. Except that we had to fight. Sorry, buddy. Unfortunate that it had to come to that. Why won't you finish me? Eh, not in the mood. As long as we draw breath, we will oppose Shinra. Now, finish it. Oh, come on. Does he, though? Or doesn't he? Because that makes a difference to Zack's character, I feel. What? Not in the mood, he said, but what did that mean? When you can. Protect Wu Tai at all costs. Three ugly Shinra soldier dudes must be punished. Who are you? Who is she? I'm Wu greatest warrior. It's over for you because now you have to face me. A little kid? This area is not safe for you. Go on home now. You're the oh. one going home. If you want to go any further, you're going to have to go through me. Aww. Oh, man. What am I supposed to do here? Baby Yuffie. Shoo -shoo ha! Take that, bad guy. <sighs> Shoo -shoo ha! Ah, no! Aww. You got me! Teach you to mess with me. Once again, I saved Wu Tai. And off she goes. Goodbye, Yuffie. 
Boy, oh boy. That's a lot of energy. What's funny is that... Now, back to work. Zack has that kind of energy to everyone else he's around. But the second that he gets confronted with it, he's like, Ooh, that's a lot of energy. Adorable, though. soldier monsters activating combat mode. well then i guess i'm just gonna have to kick your butts oh some enemies use special abilities in battle when these abilities are activated the enemy will enter a casting phase and an ability gauge will be displayed you can lower the gauge by attacking the enemy which in turn decreases the ability's impact furthermore you can reduce the gauge to zero within the allotted time you can cancel the ability entirely <laughs> Okay, so we just canceled that ability. Let's see how Blizzard works for you. Decent. Ooh, no MP cost activated. How does fire work for you? Decent. No MP cost again, huh? Great. Let me just retreat to a safe location over here. Better run for it. Better run for it. Brush assault Move level two. I got it. Good old punch and kick. That makes him explode. Classic. Hey, we canceled the ability. That's awesome. We are a little bit low on HP, so we'll take a potion here. But we're pretty full on MP, so we'll just... Do a fire here. There we go. No problem. Easy. Look at that. A little sword swing Soldier for Flair. Class Zach. Victorious again. Good work. Now get out of there. You've only got five minutes. Oh, the classic yeah. trope. This message Director will self-destruct. Are you watching? <laughs> Gotta move. <gasps> oh, uh oh. No time to play. <gasps> oh, good. I don't have to be a part of that. Fantastic. We just get to enjoy this nice, epic cutscene with our Zack. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's not good. Not good. That's what I said. And he even used the Buster Sword. You lost your focus. Uh, yeah. Oh, sorry if your sword got any wear, tear, or rust on it. You're a little more important than my sword. Oh. But just a little. Just a little. Just the tiniest, teensy bit.
Thanks. That is where we're going to actually end today's episode. So many good moments, really setting the scene. I'm learning so much about so many characters already. I didn't play the original Crisis Core. I obviously know a lot about it, having recorded voice lines for this project, but um, there are definitely still a lot of things that I don't know that I'm excited to learn more about. So all good stuff in this episode. I hope you liked it. Of course, there's more good stuff to come. Don't you worry. Stay tuned uh, for all of the wonderful, amazing, perfect, hopefully, Aerith moments uh, that are yet to come. So uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you're thinking so far. Uh, are you liking the game? Please say yes. <laughs> leave me a comment and let me know uh, what you're thinking so far. And um, that's where we're going to end everything. So please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, please remember to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss the next video. We're still uh, posting videos for FF7 Remake. We're still posting videos for God of War. Um, God of War Ragnarok is coming up soon. I haven't forgotten about The Last of Us Part 2. Don't worry, I will get back to it. Um, so that's kind of where things are. Oh, and um, some What Remains of Edith Finch coming up to the channel soon as well. So stay tuned for that. Okay, that's all. Another huge, huge thank you to all of you. I would not be here without you. So thank you. That's all. I love you all.